Hey guys, today's video we're going to talk about how should you get started in real estate? Well, my answer to this question is it really starts with having the right mindset. And we've made a couple of videos on mindset and I feel like this is something we really should talk about because it's kind of what will keep you going uh, to create that six or seven figure portfolio that you want to build in real estate. So the first thing I want to talk about is um, setting goals. So this is where, you, let's say this is where you are and this is where you want to be. So you're setting a goal to, of course, be here, but you're here. There's two different types of people. There's people who will raise their standards and um, really work hard and develop their skills and um, go through the pain, frustration, and stress and get to where they want to be, right? And there's others who will actually instead lower their standards, lower their goals to where they are at now so that they're happy, satisfied, um, whatever you want to call it. I want to talk about how um, to do, of course, the latter or the, the initial one, which is to raise your standards and set your goals. Um, so the first thing you want to do is ask, what are you willing to sacrifice? Because real estate investing, as of anything in life, it does require some sort of sacrifice. You're going to spend some time to buy that portfolio. You're going to spend some time to set it up and, you know, manage tenants and bring in tenants. Um, so that's one thing you're already sacrificing is your time, right? But you have to ask yourself, is that sacrifice of time worth what I'm going to build? So maybe what you're trying to build is a better future for your family or passive income so that you can travel the world, be able to do what you want, live life on your own terms, not have to work for a paycheck for the rest of your life, right? So once you keep that in mind and ask yourself, am I willing to sacrifice binge watching Netflix or maybe some time with friends. Um, maybe you don't go out drinking, you know, uh, with your friends or you give up some weekends of hanging out with people. Um, so that's something you might want to consider to sacrifice, right? You do always have to make sacrifices to get to where you want to be. You can have everything in life as long as you're willing to give up something. And it doesn't have to be you know, something that you feel is um, essential, an essential part of you, right? There are definitely certain habits and um, things you just don't want to give up. And that's fine. Those are non-negotiables. Like maybe it's family time. You don't want to give up um, more than a couple hours of family time to do this, right? So um, you kind of have to figure out that for yourself. Um, the next question you want to ask yourself, how can you decide to make it happen? Because there's a lot of fears and obstacles that will come up throughout your journey. And for you to make this happen, push past the off obstacles, you kind of have to have this sort of crazy courage, which means that you have to do it uh, no matter what. And even if uh, it does seem scary and you feel like you're out of your league and you know this is just too much, you've never done this before, right? Those types of fears will always be present. So you're just going to have to sometimes uh, just do it, right? Uh, push past it, take action, ask yourself, how can I do this correctly? Or how can I pivot? How can I get around this obstacle that I have? So that's just a little bit about how I set goals and how I approach obstacles. Um, and these are the questions that you should be asking yourself if you want to get into real estate. So I hope you enjoyed this video and please like and subscribe uh, for more videos and I'll release them once a week.